Hi guys, welcome back to One Cent Sports Cards YouTube channel. Doing a real quick video today to show you some quick mail that I've got from a uh, fellow subscriber of mine, and you guys have probably seen him in live streams and whatnot. Uh, he's a young collector. He goes by the name of Three Card Collectors. It is him, and I I believe he's got two brothers that he collects with. Um, and he was kind enough to send my kids and myself some mail so i wanted to open that on screen for you guys and give three cards a shout out uh he does have a website you guys can check that out i will put a, a description in the link below he is a growing channel uh still fairly small but uh as you guys know kids um kids tend to understand this internet stuff much more than myself so let's see he's got this thing taped up here so i think i'm gonna have to Give this a little bit of a rip like it would yeah so here we go um let me grab some scissors real quick and this will probably be easier way to do this um so anyways this one is a package that he sent out to uh i believe he got it on ebay and sent it directly to the kids as a kid himself he sent some stuff to me uh, for my kids, you'll see it says the one cent kids here. Um, and we'll pull this out of here and see what's inside. Um, I think since he bought this on eBay, I'm going to hide who he bought it for on eBay. We'll see if this says anything. Yeah, that's just a packing slip. So it looks like the guy on eBay, which is always interesting to see how people ship stuff on eBay. Because he sent this in a plain white envelope interesting um on top of that he put cards in here which are not <laughs> in a top loader however he did send a nice little pikachu i'm wondering what this one came out of this is 19 out of 68 so a little pikachu card for the one cent uh kids they will always love a pikachu and as we go on, make sure there's nothing else in there. Um, we're good. And then on top of that, um, we've got this piece of mail, which he mailed directly to me from his house. So this is going to me, and I have a feeling I know what it is, and that's why I wanted to record this video on screen. Looks like we've got a nice little note here. So we're gonna put that off screen here for a second. We'll take a look at the note. It says, hey, one cent, thank you for giving me a spot in Urban Card Break. So I had bought, because he's a Patreon of mine, I bought him a spot in one of Urban Card Break's uh, breaks. And he said, I actually found this card on a free cart at a church. It's interesting. I know you would appreciate this card more than I would hope you enjoy it. Three card. Well, that is awesome. And here is what the card is. It is, oh, and holy smokes. This is, in my opinion, this is absolutely amazing. This is Mr. Tim Salmon, one of my favorite PCs, um, hoisting the 2002 world champion world series champion uh angels trophy um and if you know anything about tim salmon he was he suffered for a long time on the angels without making it to the playoffs without ever getting a playoff series win um and when they finally won in 2002 he was the longest tenured angel on the team um so hoisting this trophy for the angels to him i think meant more than to him than anyone else on the team with troy percival garrett anderson uh lots of different players that they had on that team that i grew up watching uh let's see who, who made this card um so this is an actual church card um so this is he was uh so this is actually written by Tim Salmon. So this is interesting. I don't know who 
makes these. Tim Salmon may have made them his own. I'll have to look this card up. But it says, have you ever been so discouraged that you just wanted to quit or give up? I can relate to that through my recent struggles. In 2001, I experienced my worst season ever, establishing career lows in batting average home runs and RBIs. Just when I thought things couldn't get worse, I started the 2002 season in a similar slump. I began to wonder if my career was coming to an end and even considered retirement. In the midst of those struggles, I spent many hours in prayer and seeking counsel from my wife, Marcy, and others as to where God was leading my life. During that, this dark time, God shed light on what He wanted me to learn. Instead of quitting, He taught me the importance of perseverance, of trusting Him in all areas of my life, of casting my cares upon Him because He cares for me. I discovered that God's power is perfected in my weakness and that he is able to do immeasurably more beyond all I could ask or imagine. As the 2002 season progressed, I was awed by all that God did give me, and peace and all the blessings I enjoyed. Our team went on to win its first World Series, and I hit the game-winning home run in Game 2. The Sporting News and Players' Choice named me Comeback Player of the Year. I would not have experienced those blessings had I quit when times were tough. So, um... This is a this is probably a pretty rare card. Um and I actually have another Tim Salmon auto. I think I have it close by. So first of all, a three card. Thank you very much for sending that. That is a neat, interesting piece and a really cool picture of Tim Salmon hoisting the trophy. Um and I believe that that is an actual Tim Salmon autograph. So a really cool um, little piece right there that I definitely do not have in my collection. Uh, so three card. Thank you very much for sending that along. Thank you for sending a Pikachu along to the kids. Uh, you guys, if you haven't checked three cards channel out, he is a younger guy. Um, and he uh, is making videos. He's really into uh, card collecting. I strongly suggest that you check him out. Um, and, and follow his stuff. And if you can remember collecting cards when you were a kid, uh, there are things about three cards uh, collectors that you will definitely, that will definitely remind you of yourself when you were a kid uh, collecting cards. He has a lot of enthusiasm for the hobby. He's the future. It's people like him that are going to be the future of this hobby. So go ahead, go over there, check him out. If you like it, go ahead and give him a subscribe. Hit like on a couple of his videos. If you like this mail day, hit like on my video. And with that, guys, we will talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.